All right, welcome to my first ever case opening video. I actually collected Hot Wheels for a while back in the 80s when I was a child, uh, and then also uh, bought a few for my son when he was young in the early 2000s, but really kind of never kept up with it. And so just in the past six to eight months or so, I began to kind of renew my, my love and appreciation for Hot Wheels. And today is the first time I've ever actually purchased a case. Uh, purchased this case from a local Dollar General. And um, it really wasn't the case that I'm looking for, the D case. I, I have a lot of the cars from the D case already, but I figured it would still be fun to open a case, go through it, film it, and then upload it and share it so that my friends and family can, can view it as well as uh, whoever is watching it right now. All right, so this is a, as you can see, L2593. It's a US uh, box, 978D, as the D indicates, D case. All right, so one of the super, or one of the uh, cars I, I would like to find in here, I'm hopeful, is that I'll find another Mazda RX-7 Super Treasure Hunt. That was in the uh, D case, I believe. Um, never know what might be in here, if there's any other treasure hunts or not, but I know that this case does have some very interesting cars and I hope that uh, we'll find something interesting today. All right, now I do wanna point out that this box has been opened, not by me, but as I would have preferred to have opened it on camera, but by the manager at um, Dollar General. He tried to scan the box uh, and his system required him to open it and scan one of the, the cars inside the box before it would actually show up on the computer and then I could pay for him. So here is the box in all of its glory. Let's see if we can get this to stay open there a little bit more. Bend that back a little bit. Okay. Oh, here's my receipt just to show that I did put my thumb over that I don't need to know how much I paid you probably still can see it but it's okay just wanted to show that there <clears throat> all right so let's get at it they usually put them in three at a time kind of crisscross them so we'll grab three out all right so the see me rolling uh, this one has been this is new for 2021 uh, I've seen tons of these though in all the local Walmart's targets Ford GT40 in the here and now. Um, I have one of these, so now I have another one. The Pontiac GT40 in the orange. This is a beautiful car. I love this car. And I have one of these as well, but look at the detail on this. I love when they put the detail in the grill and on the lights. That is really nice. No detail on the back though, but still very nice. Okay, let me see. All right, let's grab our next three here. Okay, these are the Blade Runner, Blade Raider, excuse me, Blade Raider. It's the HW Daredevils. Honda Civic, this is a nice car, very. You know, people love their Civics. And so Honda lovers will really love this one. There's a black one also that came out later. But uh, once again, I'm a sucker for the details. Love it when they paint the um, back emblem, the lights, and the license plate like they did on this vehicle. It's absolutely beautiful. All right, and then a Speed Dozer. Speed Dozer. Sorry about the glare. There we go. That's a better angle. All right, Donut Drifter. This is a familiar one. This one has the pink icing, though, uh, or as I like to call it, the home, the Homer uh, Donut Drifter. Simpsons fans will understand what I'm talking about. Astana Hato. This one is uh, it's been around quite a bit. HW Drift. Another Simi Rollin. Let's go here. 
some of these ones that you know we've already seen I'm just going to really go through them fast another GT40 another Pontiac here's the, here's the uh, Tricera truck that is Will's you know these lot most of these I've seen in, in stores all over the place for the past you know two to three months from probably February started to see some of these so there's the Volkswagen Beetle Valentine I love the Beetle not a big fan of the uh, the Valentine paint job the surfing school bus really cool paint job I like that one I have that one already same with the Blade Runner they got like three of these now okay let's go through here I'm gonna push this thing back just a little bit it makes it easier for me to get to them okay so there's the uh, surf and turf like the surf and turf once again this is another one that I already had purchased off the hanger another Honda Civic SI which I can always use those those are pretty popular I know a lot of people that that like those and, and would want those clip rod they've made so many of the clip rods and I'm I I'm, I don't know who likes these but I, I don't get it I don't get it why they make so many of these I don't feel that it's very popular I've seen those in closeout stores all over the city all right the ion motors thresher the 89 chevelle and another tricera truck so so far nothing really special nothing out of the ordinary some nice civics though all right here is the Linster prototype I really want to see how these race I just have a feeling that these are going to be super fast and a track steer clear I love this one um, and I have this will be a second one I have now of this one the steer clear I am a big animal lover, so like, you know, animals that you would see at the zoo. And anytime you see, uh, anytime I see a, one of these Street Beast series, I kind of, like, I know not a lot of people like them, but I really like them. The Loco Motoring. All right. Okay, let's, let's go. Hey, we got an RX-7. It's the standard, which these are very beautiful, too. Earlier when I talked about cars that have detail, this is one of them. This is one of my favorites from this year that that have all the detail in the back. I mean, and that black, that jet black is just so sweet. I mean, really glossy too. Outside the case, out of the pack, um, it really shines in the light. I think I may have missed one. There was another Chevelle, 69 Chevelle, but here's the 91 GMC Cyclone, which I love these trucks too. I think they're they're really beautiful. Nice paint job, good detail, front and back. All right, Pixel Shaker. This is a tuned version of a Bone Cruiser. And um, Audacious. Art cars. I like some of the art cars. And the Chevy Silverado Trail Boss. Yep, I've, I've purchased this before as well. Still kind of cool being able to pull things out of a case and take a look at them and see what you got. All right, so we have a um, here and now 2017 Nissan G7R. These are beautiful. This is Then and Now. I really like the Then and Now series myself. Roger Dodger. This is not the Super Treasure Hunt. But 
still pretty cool. Um, I, I don't actually have a regular one of these. I had found a, my wife actually found the Super Treasure Hunt version of this one earlier um, this year. I think back in, yeah, April. But I love this, and I need a regular one. I don't have one, so that's that's cool. And then here's the Surf and School bus. Another one. All right, let's see. We got another three here. Okay, so here is the Nissan. It's another one. Just pull one out. And then the Ion Motors Thresher, another one of those, and the 2016. Ford GT race. All right, so that's the first 36. All right. Oh, didn't even drop that one. Lamborghini. I don't know if you pronounce that Urus or Urus. These are very, very nice, shiny, a lot of detail. But the factory fresh. Um, it's probably my favorite series just because of that. I'm, I like all the details that they show. Details in the light, symbols, grill. And where's the one I dropped? Here it is. This is the Diora 3. Alright, let's pull these out. Okay. Another Diora 3. Batman, I like this Batman one. I actually have probably three or four of these. The Bronco here and now. Very nice. And it's also new for 2021. Um, as I mentioned, by the time I post this, you know, these vehicles will have been out for a couple months. Here's the Hotweiler, made to look like a Rottweiler, hence the name. Hotweiler, like I said, once again, I, I like the animal one, so I'm kind of a sucker for that one. Uh, the Manga Tuner, so this is a tuned manga. It's kind of got some cool graphics on it. And another clip rod. Once again, I don't get these. All right, there is the Loopster. It's a cart. Some of these actually, they have people with their hands up. This one is the one everybody's got their hands in the cart. A lethal diesel and a Conaseg. Joko, uh, Jesco, excuse me. All right, Subaru. Very nice, high speed graphics. Twin mill. I like the twin mill. Hot Wheels original. It's been uh, done many, many times though. The Porsche 935. I like this one. And this coloration is new for 2021. Hey, another one. Right back to back. Here goes Alantia, Delta, Integrale. Very nice rally. with a lot of uh, design work. Another Subaru. Put that with the other one. Okay, all right. So now, so far we've been pulling a lot of doubles here. Um, here's a Leinster, a Jaguar. This is the first one I think we pulled from this one. Project 8, nice car. Another pixel shaker. Okay, so we got a Batman Batmobile. We have a 
Honda CRX. These are nice. I love these. I have a uh, Super Treasure Hunt from 2020. The Honda CRX. And then the Speed Driver. This one is kind of cool. It's actually a wrench. As you can see. And I think it actually would work. I'm not sure exactly what the, the size is, but I think it's a functional wrench, which makes it kind of cool. It should show us right here. I think a special feature up here. All right. So, another Ford GT race. Another Bronco. Here's one we hadn't pulled out yet. Surfs up. This bad boy got, like it did a little surfing on its own inside the box. Curved like the waves of the sea. All right, so here we go. Let's see. There's another Roger Dodger in here. Let's see if we, if it's just a regular one. <laughs> yeah, this one says most likely. Which is interesting because it's it's not a treasure hunt or it's not a super treasure hunt rather twin mill BMW okay another Z uh, jet uh, two jet Z excuse me lethal diesel BMW M3 okay oh we got both of these head gaskets right next to each other pack those in together these are new for 2021 part of the uh, HW Dare De Devils series okay. and last one is a Mars Perseverance Rover now this is not the first Mars rover, but this is the second one. But this one does have a special feature. It is the, uh, I think it's the camera that's on the top right here. And I think this camera actually spins around. Let's see if I can show it. There it goes, right there. So the camera's right there on the top. All right, so that's it. That's the end. The, cape, the case is empty. All right, so no treasure hunt, no super treasure hunt in this case at all. But um, very nice cars, and especially the factory fresh vehicles. I'm a sucker for those and some of the um, HW Speed graphics. Well, that concludes this video. You see all around the table, you see what I've got now. So I got to reorganize these and thanks for checking out, watching the video.